What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counter Punch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Tyson Fury. Dempsey McKean, get this, after frustrated Frank Warren, Tyson Fury, we may have a fight between Tyson Fury and Dempsey McKean. Angelo DiCarlo, manager of the unbeaten Dempsey McKean, has revealed that the talks have been held by Tyson Fury to fight McKean in Australia. Hmm. Let me counterpunch. Dempsey McKean is a guy that was once linked to fighting Anthony Joshua, just like Otto Vailene, just like Zilli Zhang, just like a lot of fighters, had an opportunity to win a jackpot. But I think this target is specifically for Tyson Fury simply because he is tall and rangy, he is undefeated, and he is quick. And I think it's a good fit for Tyson. I think that Dempsey McKean, um, he's a lot taller than Alexander Usyk, but he has around the same speed levels is someone like Usyk. Um, you can't say with the, you can't go with the narrative now that Anthony Joshua was cherry picking because that's exactly what people were saying when Anthony Joshua was linked to fight him. So if Tyson Fury ends up fighting Dempsey McKean, you can throw that right on out the window, okay? Because it was Eddie Hearn that was speculating or wanting to fight in Australia. Australia is a big hub for boxing, as we know. And they're trying to come back in a big way. And Dempsey McKean is there, that particular local talent that can draw these bigger fighters to that country. Okay? But at the end of the day, I think an undefeated fighter like Otto Vilene, like Tom Swartz, I think this would be another fight like that. So if Tyson really wants a fight... This would be the fight to make, you know, and I will surely say it's better than seeing fights like um, Mamu Char, uh, Jermaine Franklin, possibly, because Jermaine has really proven himself, so maybe that's a bad call, but it also proves that he can control the amount of money that he gives McKean. Okay, versus someone like Andy Ruiz that is demanding for a huge amount of money to fight the Gypsy King. Okay, even though he's a former unified champion, it still is what it is. This is a safer bet. I think this fighter will be more appreciative to take on the WBC heavyweight champion, Tyson Fury. I think it makes it more versatile where more talks to different fighters versus um, just the matchroom side or the Queensberry side or the American Al Heyman side. So it is an interesting fight to see. Dempsey McKean really hasn't had any noticeable wins. The only person that I've seen on his resume was Jonathan Rice, you know, which upset Coffee lately last year. So um, that's his most noticeable win, but he's pretty much unknown. So again, you know, say what you will about Tyson Fury. If you're going to say anything about Tyson Fury, if he takes the fight, I think the same energy should have been talked about when Anthony Joshua was in talks to take on Dempsey McKean. So there you go. One hand washes the other, right? But anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Tyson Fury linked to take on Australia's Dempsey McKean. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunched. Peace.